Hello there. In this video, we're going to review a robot by a team called RS Japan. I'm not sure what RS is short for. Uh, maybe they'll tell me. But we're going to look at the robot run, where they score 480 points. This isn't the first time I've seen the video, but I'll share my thoughts on what I think they're doing good, what they can improve, and what we can learn from them. I want to start off by talking about what a program that goes first should do. And this team, RS Japan, got it right. Programs that go first should pick up the things that your later programs use. In this case, it's the experts. And here they are. They're going to collect two of the experts near the east home area. So in this run, they have a mechanism to lift up the lid of the craft creator. They push in the drawer for the craft creator. They collect Izzy the skateboarder. They spin the chicken on the virtual reality artist. And they grab Emily the VFX director, slightly off of screen. Doing this many things in a single run is very, very good. And this run is also very quick. So, yeah. Well done. <laughs> to accomplish the virtual reality artists, they actually have some gears that engage with some gears on the virtual reality artist mission model. But also, they have a mechanical guide that is on the left side of the robot, which ensures that the robot is actually correctly positioned in order to actually accomplish the task. So I've actually never seen someone try to take the rolling camera off of the track like they do here. I think it's very clever because you don't have to worry about that orange stopper that's on the other side of the track. This is kind of a large attachment to do one task, but in a quick program like this, it's fine. I want them to add it to another run, but I'm not actually sure how they would do it. As long as this attachment is quick to take on and off, this won't be a problem though. Yes, you can absolutely take the rolling camera off the track. I tested it. See how they have the rolling camera now? And they're just going to drive it all the way over to the other home area. So they dump off a audience member near the light show and at the film set. But I noticed they do a lot of aligning, but I'm not sure they need to because the film set and the light show areas are very large. So I feel like there might they might be trying to be too precise here. And by being too precise, they lose valuable time they could be doing on other runs. The way they're grabbing Noah the sound engineer next to the sound mixer I think is very nice. I wonder if they could have had that mechanism go at the same time as those other arms though. Hold on, did that start completely in the home area or in the launch area? I'm not sure that did. I'm gonna say they did launch it completely in the launch area but it's very hard to tell. I'm sure it's quite close. And a ref may have a problem with that. Very clever. They have a mechanism that does the 3D cinema, drops off an audience member at the cinema. But notice they didn't only do that mechanism that goes to the 3D cinema. They continue to do more, which I think is very good. I actually recommended this to the Cheetahs. I actually think that this run could have been combined with the previous run if you have the mechanism to do the sound mixer on the back of the robot when the robot pushes out that other mechanism to do the dragon and the audience deliveries and the expert deliveries that happen in the area.
They're actually using the line, which is very good. I have never seen another team successfully use the line here. Generally, this year, they didn't actually do a good job of placing the lines in a useful spot. I would wonder if this mechanism that drops Izzy the Skateboarder and the audience member actually sometimes catches on this mission model. So for the sound mixer, they only actually get two of the sliders up. They can actually get three if they change that mechanism just a little bit. If it was on a flat side and they push up, and then they have the robot turn slightly to the right, they would be able to drop the leftmost uh, slider, which would then allow the middle slider, which is the hardest one to get up, uh, to stay at the top. I believe the mechanism that is on the next run is already installed on this run, which is very, very good. Because that allows them to just take the part that does the sound mixer off and move on to the next run immediately. I remember mentioning when I was reviewing the Cheetahs that they could deliver Sam the stage manager. And this is what I mean. They could absolutely just drop something off in the same mechanism that grabs a ring pull for the film set. Again, I wonder about the waiting they do. Maybe it's... I'm not sure what it's for. The amount of things they get done in this run is very impressive. It seems like maybe the robot has a little bit of trouble lifting the light show. I'm not sure. The amount of mechanisms they have on this run is actually very impressive. Okay, that was very well done. So I think RS Japan did a very good job with the robot. I actually think it's really well planned. They did not revisit areas very much. So RS Japan only really missed out on 60 points. The sound mixer, they missed out on one of the sliders, which is 10. They missed out on delivering Noah the Sound Engineer to the music concert. Which is also 10. They also missed out on the masterpiece points, unfortunately, uh, as they did not build a model. That's 30 points. And finally, they didn't flip over the orange speaker lever at the music concert and lights mission. But that's it. They scored everything else. The last thing I'll show on this video is I'll recount their score, but I'll also put in some notes on where they can score the last few points on this field.
thank you for watching the video, and I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did reviewing them. If you did enjoy this video, please do like the video, subscribe to the channel, comment down below, and share this with your friends. Finally, if you want to hire me on Fiverr to help your team succeed at the competition, please check out the links down below. Thank you.